All right, back for D and E. We've got 3.04 times 1.6. 6 times 4 is 24. Oh. 0 times 6 is 0, plus 2. 6 times 3 is 18. Bring down a 0. 4 times 1 is 4. 0 times 1 is 0. 3 times 1 is 3. Add those together. 4, 6, 8, 4. We have 1, 2, 3 decimals. So 1, 2, 3 spots. 4.864. On E, 5.23 times 4.2. 3 times 2 is 6, 2 times 2 is 4, 5 times 2 is 10, bring down a 0, 3 times 4 is 12, 4 times 2 is 8, plus 1 is 9, 5 times 4 is 20. Add those, 6, 6, 9, 1, 2. We got 1, 2, 3 decimals, 1, 2, 3 decimals, 21.966. Now let's go down to mixed review. This goes back to lessons 2C. It says plot these numbers on the number line below. A is 4.2, so we're going to find the 4. And it's more than 4, but less than 5, so we know we're in here. And it's less than half. So there is my A. I'm going to use different colors. Hopefully you can see them. For B, 8.7, so that's more than 8, so there's 8.7 is more than half, there's my B. C is 1.33, so it's more than 1, less than 2, so it goes in here. 0. 0.3 is still less than half, but it's close, so there's my C. D is 9.5, which is 9.5, so think $9.50. There's D. No Rocky. That would be the gremlin dog I told you guys about. And for the last one, I'm going to go back to green. It says E is 0. 0.75, which is like 75 cents, less than a dollar. So it's going to go right here. And there is E. Or round the decimal to the place value indicated. This goes all the way back to our uh, Canvas module, right after we took the Unit 1 test and did properties. So 4.688, well this is our tenths. So we have to look at this number, and since this is bigger than 5, we round up. This wants thousandths, which is our second digit. We look to the one over here, and since that's less than 5, we leave it alone. This wants the ones spot, so it doesn't want any decimals at all. Well, 5 is going to round that one up to a 9. Write these numbers in order from greatest to least. Make sure you pause here, try this on your own first, and then come back. Well, greatest, we look at the one spots first. So there's... Threes, twos, and ones. So we're going to do greatest. We're going to start with our threes. So 3 .3, 3 .5, 3.3, 3.5, 3.1. $3.54 is more than $3.34, which is more than $3.10. We've only got, we've got two twos. So we got 2.345. 2.34, which means this is actually a zero. This one's higher. 2.345, which leaves us with 2.34. And then the only one left, 1.222. Make sure these get put into your notebooks.